Hey, my name is Will Hobbick. I'm the CEO of Growth Co Marketing, and today I'm going to be showing you how you can embed your own SEO report tool for your Go High Level account, whether it's SaaS or your personal accounts, within the menu, and it's completely white labeled. So it looks like you're running the report every single time. You can use this in Go High Level, you can put this on your website wherever you want. Uh, but it's just a great tool for your clients, yourself to use, and it looks just super professional and it's easy to use. So just to be transparent, I'm starting out the video saying I don't want to bait and switch you and have the whole video and then say you may have to pay for something. So with this video, I'm using the SEO or you know SEOptimer website. Uh, here's the pricing. I use the white label version, so 29 bucks a month. I don't use the white label and embedding feature because that's actually what I'm showing you here. So hey, I'm saving you 30 bucks. Um, but in this case, again, 29 bucks a month, and it's completely like unlimited reports. So I think it's great. I think it's worth the money. It's only thirty dollars. So you know, if you have three clients, five clients, whatever, it's such a value add. And it just looks super professional. And you can even use this on your website to generate leads, right? That's the classic. Type in your email and your website and we'll send you your report, your uh, SEO report. We've actually done that, gotten leads out of it, just because you can set up a workflow and go high level to automatically send out the report and ask if they want to book a call. So that's what I'm going to talk to you about today, but just wanted to be transparent there. That's what 29 bucks a month for the white labeled version of this. And this actually runs the report. Okay. So you can see I've embedded this page. This is a funnel page that I built in go high level and I've embedded it in the side of the menu as a custom menu link. But as I said, this is a form on a funnel page. So you can embed the form wherever you want on your website, et cetera, send it out to clients. But let me show you what it looks like. So here I just made a simple funnel page. You know, it says our company and their SEO report tool. Just make sure you type in the website URL without HTTP, HTTPS, or www. So in this case, let's do go high level. Okay. And I click generate SEO report and it's going to immediately open a new tab completely white labeled with my color scheme. So the growth co logo here. The email to contact us on our website URL. And wow, look at that. Growth go, or excuse me, go I level, doing pretty good. Um, so you can see that here. It's really great. They have the ranking here, they have the date, they have recommendations, on page SEO results. I mean, they have everything header tags, keywords, phrases, alt attributes, analytics, rankings. I mean, they literally have everything here. It is fantastic. So definitely is a great tool to use. And the, you know, this is great for any of your clients. And again, it's completely white labeled. And you can see how quick that was, I can edit what the uh, thing says up here as well. So really cool. All right, now let's go back. So how do you actually build this? Well, let's jump into it. So first step you're going to want to do is sign up for the SE Optimer SEO tool. And again, super easy, just go to their website and you wanna use the white label plan. So you're gonna go through that and once you sign up, you're gonna to wanna to go to the login and go to report templates. So you can see that here, we have a default template that we use for everyone and you can go through and set all this up. So we have the grade, we have, you could change that to numeric, but what's most important is adding your company logo here, adding your name, you can add address, email, phone, website, all of that information here. You can hide things, show things, whatever you want. So again, this is great for a SaaS product, right? You could, you know, sell this as a SaaS product if you wanted to. And honestly, what I would do is for different levels for, if, you know, if you're targeting some sort of web niche, you know, show different things based on the SaaS level. In this case, you can choose the background color, the section color, section headers, everything, fonts, favicon, and most importantly, the title, text, and meta description. Okay, you're going to want to set all this up. Okay, and once you set it up, go ahead and click save. 
And then you are also going to want to go to your domain settings and you're going to want to set up a C name for a white labeled domain. So what's really cool is you can white label the domain. So for our example, we use reports.growthcomarketing.com. You could do whatever you want at seo.yourwebsite.com, you know, um, report you could also do a report right whatever you want you're going to just follow the simple instructions to just make a simple c name there's tons of youtube videos if you don't know how to do that uh, but i won't be going over that in this video so once you have your white label domain and your settings here you're going to want to go back to go high level all right and you're going to want to go to the form builder you can ignore my sidebar. This is just the old sidebar. So if it looks new, you're just, again, go to the form builder. It might be under sites, form builder. I went ahead and made a new form. I named it whatever. But uh, here I went ahead and added HTML. I really don't like the text. So I just typically write my own HTML. If you want to copy it, you can copy it here. I did an H1 centered, um, made it bold, and then an H or a paragraph tag centered um, and bold as well. Okay, so that's this top part. And the next part is just a website field, okay? It's just your website, um, you know, straight out of the fields tab here, website. But um, make sure for the placeholder or the field title, you put website URL, super important. Make sure to make it clear that they can't put HTTP, HTTPS, or www. That'll mess up the automation, okay? So once you do that, again, make it very clear that they can't enter those three terms in front of their website. They just have to put it as is. Go ahead and put your button here. I put generate SEO report, whatever you want. Again, for lead generation, you could put your email here as well. And what I would do is turn on inline form so it's side by side. And you could immediately hook it up to a workflow. And it's going to work the same way. And I'll show you how to send them a report in an hour and then be like the next day, hey, did you get a chance to look at the free SEO report that we sent over? We noticed some improvements that could be made. Let's book a call to talk about it. Great lead generation tool. So that's the SEO report tool form that we've made. And the most important part is going to options. After you have these three things here, you're gonna wanna go to the message. Okay, so here, my message is click here to view your, oh, click here to view your generated, it should say, report in a new tab, okay? And then if you don't know HTML or CSS, that's okay. I will put exactly what I put here in the description of the video so you can copy it. This link though needs to be, well, the a uh, href, it's like a, you know, a link and, but what you're going to want to do is in these quotations, you're going to want to put your white labeled domain that you just finished. So I had just mentioned reports dot or SEO dot, whatever you want. You're going to put that here backslash and then the tag or the, the database, you know, like call of the website. So in this case, it's bracket, bracket, contact dot website closed bracket bracket that way oh and then go ahead and add target equals underscore blank and rel equals no referral no opener this is important this is more of like a html css security thing what this target blank is going to do is open it in a new tab so i think that's really important it doesn't navigate the user away from your page but what happens is again just replace that link and this will be in the description that's all you have to do when they click SEO report, it'll open a new tab and it'll take the website that the user just entered and it's going to add it to the end of your white labeled URL and generate the report for you. Okay, super, super easy. So amazing lead generation tool. All you have to do is add an email tag and the website tag, add them to a workflow and do the same thing. So. You, you could do, um, you know, click here in your email to view your report and just have the link, which is your white labeled link, 
backslash and then this website tag to add it, okay? So that's all you have to do for the form. Now, I went to the next step and create a, created a funnel page, just a single funnel page. And you can see I added the form here as well. This is the important part. After you add the form, what I would do is go to the action and change it to go to website URL and make the website URL what you put here, okay? So the website URL needs to be your white labeled URL backslash the open open bracket contact dot website close bracket close bracket. That way, as soon as someone clicks your button, whatever the action is, clicks the button, it opens it in a new tab and it goes to that URL. That's exactly what happened here. All right. So that's what I did for the landing page. It doesn't redirect to another page. It doesn't do anything. It's just a single funnel page with a form embedded going to a URL. All I did was set that up, click save, and then all you have to do is go to the settings for your agency in the agency view, go to settings, go to custom menu link, and then just add it as a custom menu link, the link to your funnel page. So you can see this is the exact same thing. This funnel page is what is embedded here. So now any user in my agency can generate a white labeled SEO report anytime they want to either check my progress on their site or just to see in general how they're doing for their website. Equally, you could add this to your website to generate leads and funnel it into Go I Level. So that is how you do the SEO report tool generator. Hopefully that saves you 30 bucks a month if you don't want to do the white label and embedding here. You can just do it yourself and, and use that um, white labeled version here. Again, really hope this helped. Some of the information will be in the description below. But yeah, please let me know if you have any questions. My email and website will be in the description below. That's will at growthcomarketing.com or growthcomarketing.com. Thanks and make sure to check out our other videos on some Go High Level customizations.